Ah, the path of least or lesser resistance. Well, that's not where the cars go. That's not the cart spot. Cart spot, cart returns right up that way. What? Cart returns right over there. What? The cart return is right over there. Okay, what's your point? Well, the point is now that this person, let's say they want to load some groceries back here. Now they got to move around your cart. So who are you again? I'm uh, Agent Sebastian with the Cart Narcs. Nice to meet you, sir. Okay. Where are you going? Don't you, look at that guy. Thank you, sir. Appreciate you taking your cart back. Don't you want to be like him? He's a nice guy. Thanks again, sir. Where are you? Oh, you're not leaving, are you? Oh, man. <laughs> Thank you, sir. I'll say, like, now, they want, anyway, you know. You're going to be all right. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> All right, he even gave it a little victory or the, the sign. <laughs> Come on. I even explained. Uh oh, okay, what's going on over? Oh no, I don't. Okay, he's still loading. I've got a magnet for you. It says I don't return my shopping cart like a jerk. I'm just going to put that right there. Stick that for you. Oh, sir, that's a magnet. That's Oh, you want it? Put it there. Yeah, of course I did. What the fuck you doing, huh? I'm, I'm helping you learn. You want to you help me learn? Yes. You want to get your fucking self shot, you know, motherfucker? That's against the law. Okay. No, it's against the law to put something in someone's body. Salt. No, it's not, sir. Shot. Sir. That's not it. You can't shoot someone for putting a magnet on your car. No, that's, that's illegal, sir. You want to show you legal? Step up. Step up to me, see what happens. Sir, I don't want to fight you. I want you to take your car back. I'm going to fuck you up if I see you again first, okay? How are you going to do that? Now, sir, would you please be nice? Keep talking. I am talking. That's my job. Slash your fucking face. Slash my face? That's like also against the law. Why are you, why are you doing so many illegal threats, sir? Hey. <sighs> and narcoteers, typically our, uh, our policy when gun violence is threatened, and knife violence in that case, is to give them some distance. Because they've shown extreme irrationality. Sir, sir, don't beat my butt. He said he was gonna beat my. <laughs> sir, I'm helping get cars back where they go. Sorry. I'm sorry. Now the other guy's helping him a little bit. I think. You think the other guy took his cart back? Oh yeah, yeah. But yeah, our policy is once deadly force is uh, implied slash threatened and there's credible belief. Way to go, ma'am. That's going to happen. We try to keep our distance because uh, they've shown that they are not rational human beings. Of course, anybody who leaves there, oh, by the way, looks like he took his cart back. Way to go, sir. Uh, showed that he's not a rational human being. Now, as you saw, this guy, he's older, smaller than I am. Uh, obviously not as quick as I, a foot as I am either. But uh, he would have had no option, no availability. No, not availability, uh, no ability to kick our butts outside of, you know, his implication of gun violence. So we're going to let him go. Unfortunately, we've had a lesson learned, I don't believe. But thankfully, narcoteers, there are others. There are reasonable people out there, people who know right from wrong, who, who know, who know. <laughs> With, with, but how, sir? You're old and feeble. But, but you're slower than me and smaller than me. And older than me. I'm my group is I'm gonna fuck you up. Your group? Do you have like a Facebook group of lazy bones? <laughs> he says he's gonna beat my, my mother effing ass if he... Sorry. Sorry, sir? Sir, let's just have a nice talk, shall we? <laughs> well, I was about to get to, sir. I was about to get to his... I'll get his card for him, too. Again. Point being, if you let's say you want to push, oh, now I got to deal with this. Anyway, you all know the deal. Uh, thankfully, as I was saying, there are reasonable, sane people who don't lie about stuff and pretend to be able to uh, be Billy Badasses like that guy is. Let's see some of them now. The guy here in the white tee and the, uh, the short shorts. <laughs> this weather, short shorts are usually a sign of a workout bro, gym bro. So you'd think it'd be no problem for this guy to get that cart and... Not leave it in that, even though he's on the outside. Uh-oh. Okay, hold on. Nope. Full spot block. Pardon me. And an outer rim jo I guess 
Pedestrians don't have the right of way. <laughs> Full spot block, outer rim job. Cart returns up that way. Go ahead, sir. You're good, thanks. Are you a YouTuber or something? I am the cart narc. You left your cart block. You look like a, like a YouTuber. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? You left your car. It's a good thing. What, where is your channel? Oh, it's uh, Cart Narcs. We, we do, I'm on not just YouTube, but Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, the radio. Thank you for stopping, sir. You know, you can stop someone can't park here. Yeah, I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to help you. I got, just because you got me on camera. Oh, no! You should, no, no. You should do it because it's the right thing to do. You don't want to leave a cart out here. Let me, let me, let me. Oh, you, you want a, okay, you want a sticker? Hey, you want a sticker? You have a sticker. Thank you, Cart Narcs. <laughs> thank you for, thank you for doing the right thing, sir. If, if only for, <laughs> I would say incorrect reason. <laughs> Goodness gracious. And his car, it's still running, I believe. I don't watch his car, because it's, but that's the wrong, that's the wrong reasoning. You shouldn't do it because you're on camera. Character is what you do when no one's watching. Oh well, you did the right thing. Now watch your car here, sir. Oh yeah, yeah. I guess technically, uh, Cart Narcs is, although we have more subscribers on Facebook than we do on YouTube. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. Uh, and I think even more on this too. Anyway, point is, <laughs> I, I don't like being called a YouTuber because it has uh, negative connotations. A lot of those guys are jerks. You don't have the uh, best intentions at heart like Cart Narcs do, but look, he got, the, the job got done. Again, do it because it's the right thing to do. Okie narcoteers, this guy clearly a uh, able-bodied dude. He is parked very far out though, relatively. Now there's a cart return right there. Let's see, <laughs> I don't think he saw us, so. You see the cart narcs, we try to, uh, for folks who don't know, we talk about this in interviews and stuff, is we try to time it as we arrive just at the moment of truth. I need that for you, sir. Appreciate it. Yes, sir, so like a lot of folks, They'll just like duck, ditch it up on the curb or whatever, or like over in one of these spots. Not you, you were walking back, right? It's coming, no, it's coming, I promise. Yeah, but you know, that's why, that's why, I, offered I, promise, to take, that's why I offered to take it for you, because I could tell, you know, body language, like, oh, no, he said it's some. I'm not gonna, I'll, I hate those people that do Ah, very nice. <laughs> Thank you, sir. And narcoteers, we usually don't make these busts. Also, they are incredibly hard to spot as they're happening. But, oh, so often. And a lot of tenants talk to us about this. At least it's not leaking and it's, I, not even, I mean, it's obviously soaking wet from the rain. Um, but goodness gracious, there's a trash can up front. We'll get a bag or something and get it up there. But uh, come on, parents. I know I know, it's not the easiest job in the world, but you could at least leave it in your trunk or something until you get home. Uh, Cart knocks out.